Hey guys, Good welcome morning. to a new weekly vlog. It is Tuesday, the it's Tuesday, the, the 14th, 14th of, of August. August. We are going this morning to shoot. We've got about two, one duo outfit, one solo outfit, and a couple of um, outfits to shoot for our, our digital client, Amy and Anna. Which is good. We are going to one of our usual spots um, in Albert Street. In R Albert Street? No, it's in Richmond somewhere. I don't know. It's I don't think it's East Street. Melbourne. It's like near the Treasury Gardens. Yeah, it's the back of Treasury Gardens. I can't remember the actual street. We always just go there. We know how it's to drive. It's the back of the Treasury Building. Yeah. So we're going there, um, and afterwards, I'm trying on wedding dresses. Wow! Wow! So we'll include a little bit of the footage into here from there, but most of it will be on IGTV. So if you if you're not getting enough through here you should probably go on instagram page and look at igtv through there it's very exciting um going to one day bridal this um salon their studio in um south, south melbourne. melbourne very exciting i'm most likely be getting a custom made dress but i've never tried dresses before so it'll be the first time so mum came with this as well which would be awesome but yeah we'll um my little instagram story sure don't see why not oh uh, i'll just tell Nana to look <laughs> anyway um, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. Juice is disgusting. <laughs> it's really, really sour. Now I'm an orange juice snob because of Greece. All the orange juice is like a freshly squeezed, sweet, pulpy. It's like someone's like squeezed it. Like it's beautiful. Like, it's like it's very, very bitter. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 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 Yeah. 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 I've just finished Pilates at KX Pilates. We got the one in Bourne and we did um, a session with Andy. Yeah, Andy. He's, huh? Andrew. Andrew, Andy. He was great. It was very like leg weighted exercises. Just good. Um, feeling good, a bit tired. My neck's still a bit sore. My ankle's still pretty sore, but she realized that it's because of her knee um, and it's had compounded as so her ankle hurts trying to compensate for her yeah. knee. Huh? Explain. So because I have, um, I have brush my teeth while you explain. Yeah, totally. Um, a long time ago, a couple of years ago now, I damaged my um, ACL, my cruciate ligament on my left knee, and it's totally fine now. Like I have really have no issues with it. Just my left leg is naturally weaker now, so I've got to be careful with um, just exercise and just constantly building up the strength in my left knee. And because in the, this past month we've done no weight training, it's all been. Um, in Greece, walking around, um, my knee is weaker and that's why I believe my ankle um, has been sore out of nowhere. Just alerting me, hey, your left leg's weaker and I'm struggling a little bit. So that's what I kind of realized throughout this morning doing Pilates. I was like, oh, my, it's probably compounding the injury and um, just the weakness in my leg and my ankle's a bit sore. So I just really focused today, took it slow. We're doing like single lunges single leg lunges and I was really focused, um, didn't use dumbbells when I was on my left, but my weight was on my left knee, which is my bad knee. Um, I was really focusing on the, mo the movements and um, just trying to hold as much pressure as I could on my knee, but not doing too much. So it's gonna be a slow process, I think, just making sure this knee, my left knee is stronger, so I feel confident. Um, and then, cause yeah, I, since I've been doing Pilates the past, before winter Greece for like a full two months and then PT, I had no complaints. My knee is perfectly fine. Um, I'm still cautious of when I do like single leg things, but it could pretty much hold the weight equal um, to my right knee. But definitely noticed um, today at Pilates that I couldn't do what I was doing single leg, like on my right leg, on my left leg. So I definitely think that my left leg, um, the muscles are definitely much weaker since the past month not doing any exercises. So really good that I've noticed that now. Um, so I can just start 
doing more single leg things, focusing on building this knee up again and the strength of my leg so I don't have these little niggly issues. So yeah, but now I'm having my second coffee of the day. I think I had a, what's the caramel one called? The, car the caramel color is called Levanto. Having Levanto strength coffee um, for my second one. And we're, yes, and we are going, we are going to Port Melbourne to have a meeting with our clients, Tusk and Tan and Milano Boost. It's exciting, haven't seen since before we went to Greece, so this should be nice to catch up and say hi. Yay! And then just yes. so hang out with them, sorry it's Green Plastic Bag. Hang out with them and um, just coffee. chat before. Have a yarn. Yeah, I think. Um, but like, if anyone watched The Bachelor last night, what are your thoughts on Ka Cassie? I'm like, cuckoo, loco. She stage five clinger. Someone called to get a, what's it called? Australian water. AVO, Australian water against her. Bat shit. Anyway, we will catch up with you guys after our meeting, but just thought I would touch base and say hello. I'm wearing a very similar outfit I've been wearing. I've been back in Melbourne because I'm very confused what to wear. It's wearing all black <laughs> and blue jeans. And I've got these clothes. cool bands on. They're actually really good because they're comfy and I'm not wearing, I don't know where socks, but my feet are still covered. So I'm happy. So anyway, we'll catch up with you guys later hey on. Hey guys, so we just got back from our meeting with Milano Boost and Tuscan Tan. Some really exciting things ahead, which is awesome. Um, got back to his deliveries, like a box and a bag, like a satchel. Um, so in the box, it's from um, Melly Mello, um, they're based in the UK, but they're made in Italy. Um, it says, dear Becca and Marissa, I hope you love new Melly Mello bags. The perfect additions for your luxurious lifestyle. <laughs> luxurious. Can't wait to hear style at Fashion Week with Love from London, Melissa. So, we've got a lot of Fashion Week. Love to London. We're going to New Zealand Fashion Week, obviously. So, I think I swap bag. One more swap one too. Got a bag each. I went with this style here. I don't know if the style name is attached. Let me have a look on the inside. The only thing that I wasn't like, yay, about these bags is that the um, hardware is in silver when I'm a gold hardware. Was it gold? No, it's silver, which is a bit annoying, but it's fine. The, the, tan, the bag is tan, so it kind of it's warm enough to counteract that the hardware is silver. Um, but it's got like a drawstring. It's kind of like the bucket bag so in at the moment. Really, really popular to have like a drawstring. I don't think the style name is in here. No. But it's like a really deep, um, perhaps. Yeah, so it's the Santina Mini Woven in tan. So it's got the drawstring here, which you can kind of like push in, and the brown sort of uh, bucket bag holding thing. And you can remove, you can add a long strap as well. So you can remove these all together because these little like hook and eyelet sort of style. Um, and you can use the longer strap if you prefer. I'll have the longer strap on it anyway, I think, only because um, I like the versatility of having both. Like say, if we've got a busy day ahead and in the morning I can carry it like a little on my, like the crook of my arm. But when I'm busy in the afternoon, I need to like, you know, chuck it over my shoulder um and marissa got oh wow marissa got a box bag um very similar to like the astral london styles we get because we love a good box bag let me just take all this little plastic wrapper off and marissa's is silver with gold hardware so you can there's that versatility being able to use both metals when you wear this one it's got a shoulder strap but it's just a carry um bucket so start the bucket box bag and at the back it says light the way which is really really cute it's this full metallic sort of cracked leather leather it looks beautiful and all the embossings in gold all the um hardware is in gold Whoa. i know she's, in front she's really awesome and then marissa can remove this box and all its contents out of the way and the rest of that out of the way so cool i really like the fashion week and plus got silver with gold so i thought i can wear both yeah really good and then we got another delivery and from light the way jesus lights our way he does and then the next delivery we got which is from um max media lab again i love the girls from media lab they're the best, the best. um actually we um they gave us a new ghd gold 
our one broke while we're in Europe and I don't know what's wrong with it. Um, but Did it have to it? No, they're like sending a return. Oh, I do. Can you? the video then. It's a lot of time. So yeah, it was a replacement. Yay. Yay. Which is great because um, like we're using our old, old, old one from 10 years ago. It's this really is so nice. cool. I'm so happy. It's really nice. Because I had a limb and I was like, oh, it might be a little weird, but it's really cool. It is really cool. Look at these weirds. It's a nice little bag, but I like it. We need to style a photo shoot, which we're doing tomorrow. We're redoing those outfits I shot the other day because the, they came out so cack. I was like, no, no, the photos sure. were perfect. Just the color and the lighting, just atrocious. Was not much with our current. It, it was atrocious. Was really it was absolutely atrocious. Um, so we're going to redo those. And rather stressing ourselves it out and back trying to edit it a thousand times over, I was going to reshoot it. We're shooting with um, a friend of ours, Lenny, from Lenny Flashes. Um, just because Katie is a uh, book, not she booked out, she's um, I'm married. I'm she's getting married. So um, she has, she's out of office, which is fair. Um, and so we were, we were obviously not going to bother her into a tripod, but then they came out so poorly. We were like, crap, we need to get a photographer. And Katie isn't available. So we emailed Lenny and she back from Bali like two days ago. And she's like, yes, sounds great. So we can do street style. We have to style one more outfit of our own. And it'll probably just be, it'll probably just be like a like skirt short and top and jacket. Hello, guys. It is Hi. Friday morning. It's like 11-ish. Just about to hit 11. We're going to PT now at our local park. Yay. Very excited. I'm a little bit sore from Pilates yesterday. Oh, I'm going to wear hamstrings away. That bad. Oh, I think because you know that one exercise that was like a deadlift. I did. It was like a good morning. No, no like these ones, and you were doing it without weights. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's like a good morning. And I was like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. In the moment, you're like, that's not gonna hurt. This is fine. And then that's once, all hamstring stuff. Once and you're like, the next oh, day, it's... you're like, so, so yeah. Doing that now, and then afterwards, um, we've got to we have to be at home for a little bit, and then we're going out. You need to shoot, um, yeah. to vlog it's so much easier to vlog when only one of us is shooting a solo outfit so like i could just like have the camera and vlog um we shot it in the city obviously we shot two duo looks and one solo look um which is awesome um uh, yeah it was cold but it was fine didn't get parking fine bonus um yeah i think we told you guys earlier that um obviously we couldn't shoot katie because she's getting married tomorrow and she's like obviously off for the whole week and we didn't she's like oh, katie told us you i'd shoot you guys anyway but also i don't want to bother her like it's her wedding week like let you just do you katie um shot with lenny she's great went really well super easy super chill um went back to the supermarket on the way home and i'm home now lots of emails to go through uh, a little bit of work just a little bit of organizing for next week because you don't really know where we're all gonna be like marissa's gonna be and i'm gonna be it's got a lot of like commitments next week in terms of like um, going to cafes and restaurants and stuff for paid promotion work. And we need to pick up like our dresses for Marissa's engagement party and options to wear and all that stuff. So um, just want to touch base and say hello. Discover these delicious snacks the other day from like the IGA. They're called Table of Plenty. And this whole is only 16 calories per rice cake. And they are so bloody delicious. Like, it's got it's like a rice cake. It's gluten free with like milk chocolate on top. It's all gluten free. We had we discovered these in Greece, um, not realizing they do them in Australia, and they do. The so I just bought four packets. <laughs> you bought four packets. Sure did. Now bought all the packet. Wow. Worth it. Anyway, um, watching the footage tonight. I'm just gonna get in this. 
How is PT? How sore are you out of 10? Oh, I'm like a five or five. I'm like an eight. Oh, tomorrow I'm gonna be like an eight for sure. We need lots of legs. So Hannah like loaded up our legs. So uh, we backed up yesterday with lots of legs. My hamstrings, like I said earlier, are like more so now. But it feels good. It's good pain. I'm happy back at the gym. Um, I'm really excited to like get in shape again. Not the way like not in shape, but we've just lost a lot of muscle muscle. Um, and probably more than we realized we actually had. Is that right, miss? Yeah. Good morning, guys. Hello. It's Saturday morning. As you know, makeup's done. Going to Katie's wedding. Makeup's not all, all done, but mostly done. Yay, got now it's done. But we're getting ready now. I've done my makeup besides mascara. I'm going to use this new NARS. My highlighter is popping. Wow. I want to blind everyone. <laughs> we got the new Climax Mascara from NARS yesterday from Mecca. I think it was delivery got yesterday. Really exciting. I'm going to give that a shot of my eyes. I'm going to put... I might not do the eyeliner in case I cry. And by in case, I mean like when we, we will, cry. when we cry. But might just leave you here so you can watch Marissa get ready. I'm doing my hair. Let me brighten this up a little bit because with this, um, I don't know how wide this barrel is. I feel like two inch barrel. Um, I usually use a thinner one, but this one um, just gives really nice curls for my hair when. I need it to look nice like at that minute. Like I usually use um, a tighter barrel one when um, like first thing in the morning I've got it in the evening or like when I do it at night because I brush it out several times um, and it creates the perfect kind of like way my hair all combines together. But considering the events today and I want it to look nice straight away. Well, this mascara is nice. I've gone with this barrel. Look at my eyes. Don't fuck with Marissa. Focus on me. There you go. Yeah, look at my eyes. With, without. With, without. Nice. Back to Marissa. Um, so yeah, I'm going to also attempt to put contacts in. Still not oh not completely ready. We're about to leave in about five minutes. Yeah. My lipstick uh, my lips aren't even because you put lipstick on. Um I never know how to like fix the foundation situation on my lips. I don't know. Anyway, I'm just wearing boggy clothes. We're so getting changed um at the bridal suite. Just gonna put my dress in a garment bag. These are our dresses. So Marissa's green, mine's like teal. teal. Um and right now I'm just wearing slides. But we're basically good to go. We'll touch base with you when we can. Probably at the bridal suite when we film our outfits. By approval by Katie. So, see you guys there. I'm here, ready for the wedding. Getting photos done now. I am wearing a dress from Find Me Color Label. It's really nice. Got my Dreja Rossi heels on. I've got um, necklaces from Grace. Um, this one's Jolene Dean, these two are from Greece, from I Love Jay. Got earrings from I Love Jay, also from I Love Jay. And glasses are just regular for vision. It's Monday. We didn't vlog yesterday. I vlogged a little bit yesterday. I'll just like insert. I would probably have inserted the clip right before this. I literally just oh, where's my hair. I literally just vlogged like my breakfast. Mm -hmm. Well, my breakfast. It was like the coffee. <laughs> Delicious. Um, which I'll just share now. 
Anyway, we had Katie Men's wedding on Saturday, which you would have seen us getting ready for. Um, I'm not sure if we have any footage of the actual wedding. Not in, in because the cat, the um, it was like a really dark day, it was gloomy, and so the room was really like low light, so we didn't really like a vlog. And we kind of just wanted to enjoy watching our best friend get married. Yeah, um, it was a great night. I'd say it's a Kilda, Marissa, and Niall went back home. Um, but yeah, it was great. Uh, they were so happy, they had the best time, which is the most important part. Yeah. Um, and so then yesterday I got back from St Kilda around one, maybe a bit earlier, and I just watched. Sorry, um, I watched this TV called Ambulance. I really like it. We've recorded like six episodes because I was overseas. Watched that. That's about it. Did nothing. Um, and now it's Monday. I'm getting a delivery today. My Zara order. Mm. Super exciting. I'll show you some bits and pieces. Oh, I'll just do an actual haul. Oh my gosh, guys, remember that bloody Topshop order that <laughs> I made before we went overseas? I actually can't figure that mine out. What I know that massive kerfuffle and my stuff never came. And I kept calling the, co the courier company every day, like three times a day. Now it's coming today. And it never did. Yeah, it arrived the day we were on the plane to Greece. Literally, like the Monday, wait, Tuesday we left at like, Three in the morning, our flight was five in the morning. It arrived at ten. Literally. Literally. Anyway, but the bag's there, so I'll show you the bag because it's like right there. Shuffle around, my friend. So this is the bag I got. It's really cute. It would have been perfect for being in Greece because. It's like this rattan, it's light, it's got big strappy handles for over your shoulder. I could have held it like this, it would have been great for photos. It's not very like, you can't really open it much, but it's very big. I could have put water bottles in there, could have put cameras in there, sunscreens. It would have been perfect for our holiday. Alas. Anyway, I got the pants, which we posted on Instagram already. I wanted a photo of my face. Uh, and. stays there and then I got these are the shoes which would have also been perfect for Greece I got them in white which would have also been perfect for Greece look this little You're right in my room. Mm. little they got a strap around the foot little they would come in handy something else I know but they're perfect for Greece yeah. like I don't want to wear these heels in Melbourne if I'm going out for like dinner or drinks no, anyway and then I lace up the ankle they're really pretty and I'm just bloody annoyed so and more annoyed with the white pair because they were, would have been perfect for Greece. Like mm. now imagine if it's a fake tan, they got fake tan all over them. Mm. Anyway, that's my rant. Ah! Well, this is Beck Zara delivery so far. She got a, I don't know if I like the jumper. <gasps> uh, uh, yeah, it's fine. And the pants are cool, yeah. We like the pants. Okay, let's try it. Okay, this is the next pair of trousers. They are a corduroy clot. Turn around so we can see. Just like trying to figure out how they have this belt situation. Don't hate. Also, I'm not angry at them. Don't hate. Probably would return though. Can you just go to that corner so I can see like a full, full body of you? Because I don't like how they bunch in the crotch area. Like I'm like walking. Yeah, they have, they think a bit too much fabric. Yeah, they're very there's too much of them. But I do like the ankle. I do like them, but well, don't love. Yeah. Okay, these trousers are definitely a ten. They are. Oh, no, they're not a ten. They fit. They don't fit nicely. What do you mean they fit nice? The fabric's shit. Yeah, the fabric seems a bit cheap, but I like the style. I don't know if I told you guys we're in New Zealand Fashion Week. Yeah, like. I cannot see from this far, so you don't have to go right to the edge of the, where the mirror is and turn around and show me. I like the pants. I think they're cool. Do they have belt loops? Yes. Okay, great. That's a good sign. They're a bit like um, big in the waist. That's fine. It's the same as this belt loop. You can put belt. Like, I'd have to. I want them like. You know, like yeah. Just do that. Easy. 
but they look really nice. They're comfy. I yeah, like them. Like, like, with jumper like this. Yeah. And like, you know, comfy. Yeah. For a bum bag. I still feel really cool. I like them. Took us a Pauline bag. You know, like, comfy. Yeah, I rate it. Yeah. Sick. Next. So the last pair, Beck got with a pair of skinny jeans and they're boring, so. People want to see skinny jeans. I got a 36, so it's not like that. Oh, that's going to be size 8. That's, I'm never, I'm usually size 38 in all Zara jeans. Well, they just aren't skinny. I did yeah. my size predictor. Oh, okay. Then... And I said, well, how do you want the fit to be? I'm like, very tight. <laughs> well, it was like, had Spray a scale on. of like, <laughs> tightest to like, loosest. And then, Spray on. <laughs> on the tightest side of life. I want it to be like leggings. Leggings. So I do make really comfy skinny they, jeans though. These are they're like 50 bucks. And they're too. soft and they're super comfy. I'm, I can't deny that. Like, these are good pair of jeans. Like, they look nice. Like, I like the front ankles. Yeah, it's cute. These are like yeah. an everyday pair of jeans. I, I need a new pair of black skinnies that fit like. A glove that are high waisted ish that aren't the bloody target ones that I actually don't like. I don't like them anymore, no. These are faded black, so I'm like. Beautiful! Okay, well, that is our Zara order and also the Kirsten Ash jewelry. So, that is us for today. If we get any more deliveries, we'll definitely show you. So, I'm gonna return the white quarter pa corduroy pants. Yeah. But if we get any more deliveries, show you. If not, see you tomorrow in the next weekly vlog. Oh, yes. See you in the next weekly vlog. Bye.